open you up. Ready to go?
can break this now. <laughs> Enemy over there. Vault Hunter, I got the fire in my breast and a gun in my hand. 
We're gonna take back the last key fragment, and I figured out where it is. The Jacob's Powder Cellar. What's a powder cellar? Well, that's where my family cascades our signature gunpowder. My father must have hidden the fragment in a barrel of Grand Reserve black powder before the Calypsos arrived. Clay knows a secret way to get in. Go and meet up with him. This'll require a two-pronged attack. Vault Hunter, while you infiltrate the cellar, Alistair and I will slip past the Harpy's Zealot Guard. Tonight, we take back Jacobs. Here, here. I'm over by the waterfall when you're ready, Vault Hunter. <laughs> I'm shipping off the brighter shores. Promethea, here I come. Come, Night Splinter. Embrace me! like we ought not be idling about, and yet. You smell like mud and betrayal. It's quite the musk. Man, I am bored. Someone, do something! Oh, you mighty crushing bone! Praise your name! Protect my home! Well, the Amber Mile tried to put you in the mud, didn't it, Vault Hunter? Good to see you're still on dry land. Smell like mud and betrayal. <coughs> Bolt Hunter, I cannot excuse Aurelia for what she's done to Wainwright and the people of Eden Six. She must answer for her crimes, but she is still my sister. If I could speak with Aurelia face to face, I might convince her to surrender. Enough blood has been shed, and sometimes the bonds of family can be repaired. I ask only for a brother's chance. Over here, Vault Hunter. Follow my lead. Montgomery Jacobs showed me this little side entrance back in my smuggling days. He was a great man. And I owe it to him to see that the Jacobs Corporation gets back in Jacobs' hands. Wainwright will make a damn fine head of the company, assuming any of us make it out of this alive. Let's get a move on.
Here we are. This passage seems inconvenient. A party trick, perhaps? Yeah, Jacob's family loves their secrets. This passage will put you right underneath this state. Stay smooth, operator. <laughs> It should have put you smack dab in the powder cellar. The moving and watch your stray shots. beast. We use old booze 
barrels to give every shot from a Jacob's weapon the proprietary aromatic profile our customers trust and love. Every batch is unique. I prefer an oak brandy cask myself. Oak takes longer than you think, but it's worth the wait.
We're getting good at this beast. Nope. Hells, bells, the fish was a red heron. Watch out for more zealots, Vault Hunter.
This is it! Vault Hunter, press the button! Got the Grand Reserve! Ha <laughs> ha! What'd I tell you? Easy as pie! Key fragments should be right inside. A team success is what that is. Now we can open the vault. Come meet me and Alistair near the gardens. I'll open up the way for you. Just follow the conveyor system out of that room. Out the loot. An item there. Ha! 
That stuff any good? Aurelia, as your brother, I implore you to stop this. Step aside, Alistair. Well, I trim the last loose end of the Jacob's line. If you want to kill Wayne Wright, then you will have to. Yes, I know. Are you all right? Me? What about you? You were shot just as much as I was. Oh, I'll be fine. Not the first time I've had lead in my belly. Just have to clench. Ha! Oh. Thank you, Volt Hunter, for giving her every chance and for humoring a blinded fool of a brother. Your wounds, are they dire? We will survive the trip back to the lodge. It's up to you to finish the task, Volt Hunter. Right, the vault. To reveal the entrance, you'll have to solve some light statue-based riddles out in the gardens. 
The only puzzles I enjoy are putting skeletons back together after I have removed them from their owners. Oh! Oh, I do apologize. Are you hearing this, Alistair? The Vault Hunters lost all whimsical intrigue. Forgive Winnie, he gets cranky when he's been shot. Do just try solving the riddles, Vault Hunter. The first statue is out there on the terrace. You just have to recreate how the subject died. Once you clear the path to the vault, I will join you with the rest of the vault key. Singleton Talbot Jacobs. Quite the eye for detail he had. Even if it caused him to miss the big picture. Listen to the recording for a hint. sails to rocket. He peered too near at a marksman's gear, and the bullet went right through his socket. Singleton was keen with tools. He kept a wrench in pocket to finally tune the tools of war that caused his sails to rocket. He peered too near at a marksman's gear, and the bullet went right through his socket. The man was shot in the face. Did you catch that part? <laughs> the man was shot in the face. Did you catch that part? Singleton got held up, and all he cared to do was inspect the bore of the robber's rifle. That is, until the robber shot him in the face. Head to the menagerie next. Hostile, marked. See the chest? Installed by my great uncle Maddox. Maddox didn't trust a soul. The man preferred having bars between him and the rest of the world. He once measured his spaghetti on the suspicion that his cook was short noodling him.
Be that there? Concentration was on ruination. The gun at his back went kaboom. Yep, old Maddox spent so much time looking out the window, he never noticed that his butler was blocking his demise. Ah, uh, gothic drama. The final riddle is in the greenhouse. Thrilling. You really wanted that one, eh? Feel the bloodlust! was installed by my grandfather, Warden. The first Jacobs to sell firearms to someone without a mustache. A man of great vision and great greed. It was him that made Jacobs into a galactic name, even if it was just a means of lining his wallet. Let's see if my knife is in your skull. Just lend to never! Pathetic creature. 
It's time to fight! Jacobs. He catches up to me and demands to know where I was going. So I say, you know where I'm going, Monty. Then I hear the click of a pistol chamber, and he says, Jacobs might have escaped the big war, but the next one is coming. The war of the vaults. Good thing there's no vault here, huh, De Leon? I nod slowly. And if the great Typhon De Leon couldn't find that vault, no point in anyone else looking. He smiles and hands me a solid gold revolver. Mm. Pleasure doing business with you, De Leon. Wharton waxed his boots and floors to show off his great profit. So burnished was the catwalk that he stepped and slipped right off it. The worst of the falls went right to his balls. The damage was catastrophic. Wharton tripped in the factory and died, or, well, the doctor had to invent a new name for his injury. Called it fatal testicular devastation or some such thing. An innovator till the end, my grandpappy was. See, you sniffed all those riddles out like a saurian in heat. Head back to the terrace. There'll be a switch to reveal the entrance to the vault. See, Winnie? The vault hunter enjoys solving elaborate puzzles as much as you do. Yes. Yes, I do suppose the heart of an adventurer still beats within you, Vault Hunter. You are close. I keep one in my jacket pocket. <laughs> like your enthusiasm, please. <laughs> Another alpha. There can only be one. <laughs> Small price to pay, I think. 